Well, hello everyone. This is a new tutorial video about optimization, and uh, this video, in this video, we're gonna fix some issues from another component. With one of the subscribers, uh, we were able to find two issues, and the first one, let me show it. Uh, that sometimes uh, instances are not removed. Well, let's fix it now. Let's open our instance replacer component, a component that we're adding to a nectar that uh, holds all hisms. In our case, for a nectar with a sphere, and open event graph. Here we have on and overlap, and we're calling a replace actors with instance every time when overlap ends. But uh, and also we have some checks here, like should be replaced and so on. Well, let's open instance replaceable actor now for actor, and as soon as uh, it was replaced already, then uh, it should not be replaced again. And because the problem now is uh, that we can replace one actor a few times. So let's open instance replaceable actor, and on replaced component with instance, we're gonna set should be replaced to false. Oops. Compile and save. And back on replace instance with actor. Right after everything here, let's add a new node to a sequence. We're gonna set should be replaced to true. Well, now back to an instance replacer. Okay, we don't need to do anything here. I think that it should be a fix. Well, now everything is an instance. And oh, I replace uh, replace instance with nectar, so it's not called. It's not called because we have a check here. We should not have it here, by the way. On begin overlap. Okay, what should I provide here? I don't know. Component. Okay, we should not check, should be replaced here. Compile and save. Well, now it works. And now when instances are not, uh, instances are removed correctly, like this. Okay, and now we have one more issue. And the second issue is that when we have an instance is close to a player from a beginning of a game, they are not replaced with an actress. So we have to run away, then turn back, and only after that they are replaced. But they should. Okay, then let's open instances replacer uh, component. And here on uh, begin play, we're replacing actors with instance. Well, by the way, we should uh, get actors to replace, should not return us all actors with this tag. It should also filter actors that are close to a player right now. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna get our on event graph, we have a function called stop player, and it returns us a box collision or a sphere collision whenever you have. Let's promote it to variable and call it um, overall. I'm just gonna call it overlap collision and connect everything. Well, now on a function that we've created and get actors to replace, we have to get this overlap collision and get overlapping actors. So, and we have to subtract these actors from this array. And the class filter is gonna be just actor, by the way. Well, remove items, okay. And we have to remove items and uh, can we just convert it into a set? Make set. 
well looks like not so let's maybe make set ready well we have to move it a little bit here and here we're gonna create a set of these collisions right on the start of a function let's create a new variable and call it uh, overlapped actors of type actor and it should be a set well now we're gonna get it and add maybe we can add an array yeah we can even add an array so it will look like this now here we are removing items from all actors with this tag and we have to provide a set, set so we're providing it with overlapped actors and finally we are returning this array so let's test it out they're still replaced because I'm returning in a call of a function a result of a function call so what we're gonna do we're gonna promote this uh, uh, to a local variable and call it uh, actors to replace now we connect actors to replace to remove items and finally we have to return an actors to replace compile and save they still replaced well maybe okay get overlapping actors maybe this is empty for that moment one yes one actor and it should be my test actor great let's set attack here a breakpoint i mean okay one actor here one actor here and one here we are after removal after a removal well Overlap actors is zero. Oh. oh, we're removing items from a set and not from an array. Remove item. We can remove only item from an array, and uh, that's a problem. So uh, what we're gonna do now? We have to remove. Okay, let's maybe do it like this. Let's create a new local variable. Oh, okay, let's make an actors to replace a set, not an array. First, let's delete this so that Unreal will not try to replace everything. Let's make an actors to replace a set and get it here. Added items. Like this. Well, now we can get our actors to replace and let's see uh, how this is called. And we have to use a difference. So that it will return us a set of items that are not intersecting. It will remove all intersected actors. And overlapped actors go, go here and connect this compile and save so this is how a function should look like let's try it now now they are not replaced with an instances and everything works fine well to test it one more time i'm gonna just duplicate this actor and put it here so this one yes uh, this that far from a player is replaced and this one that is close to us is not so I think that all of the fixes uh, for now if you found some issues on your site feel free to contact me we'll try to fix them thanks for watching